All right, welcome back to Sword of Mana. Um, I kind of want to preface this episode a little bit. So I tried to record this episode, and you can see I'm a much higher level now. Um, there's a dungeon we have to go through, but I kept dying over and over and over. So I took a bunch of time yesterday, and I grinded a bunch of levels, um, put some levels into some other classes because my magic defense and stuff was so low like I couldn't um, I would get hit by one magic attack and just be done and there are a lot of enemies in this next dungeon that have magic attacks but I also upgraded some of my weapons and armor and stuff and so um, I can do a lot more damage, I'm not taking nearly as much damage, I have a whole bunch more HP and MP so I can heal. Um, actually one of the classes um, gave me one of those upgrades so I heal more when I use um, the Light Spirit now. Oops. Master Devious awaits! So this'll be... Hopefully a bit easier than it was before. See, these guys, I don't even know. Yeah, these guys are immune to, like, pretty much everything. Ow! How did you hit me from all the way over there? Alright, run past you, run past you. I'm gonna go down here. Though, I don't think I can do anything over here yet. Oh yeah, I can. This is the way I'm supposed to go. So, I'm gonna move through this pretty quickly. Um, because I've already done it. And there are only certain enemies that I can actually hit in here, so we probably won't be leveling up a whole bunch because... Just because I'm only going to use the sword, and there are only certain enemies that I can hit with the sword. Like these guys. Yeah, see, now I'm starting to do like over 100 damage if I hit the right hit, you know? So... That's cool. But yeah, like there's those werewolf looking guys that are in here that use magic attacks that do a lot of damage and they hit you multiple times, so hopefully they won't hurt nearly as much now. Yeah. Just destroying dudes. And I should have a lot more um, agility, so I hopefully won't miss nearly as much. Gummy frog. I'm just gonna do that so I can get past him. Oh. And I learned that you can jump over those as long as you don't mind taking the damage from them. But only some of them. Like, I don't think I can jump over that one. Oh, hi. Ooh. Ouch. But see, yeah, now I heal 40 instead of only 30. Oh. Okay. Nope. I'll just go this way. Oh. So I need to hit another bell. Oh, there's the bell. But how do I get there? It's probably through where that other magic stone was. Yeah, so like right through here. Because that's... I think it's Jin. Yeah. More items. Choco lump. Yeah, this is much easier than when I tried to record this before. Ooh, wind coin. I'm gonna do that. Oh! Wrong spirit. Wisp. Ow. 
Yeah, so this is the way to get to the bell, I'm pretty sure. Oh, and there's nothing back here. I thought the bell was right here. Maybe it's in the next room. Yeah, he was about to use a magic attack on me. Yeah. It's down here. Ooh, there's two of them. Maybe I have to ring them both? Get the chest. Grand steel. Sweet. Yep. Yeah, those little guys, I don't think I can hit them either. Nope. I think I have to use, like, the gloves, like a bash, um, it's like a bash weapon, I think it's called. Jump over them. Oh, I missed. Dang it. Alright, get out of here for a second. Because I'm hitting a lot more than I did before, but I'm still missing quite a bit because my agility stat wasn't very high. Because the uh, fighter class doesn't increase agility. Hardly at all. Ow. But maybe we'll level up like once. Healing up. There we go. Jumping over dudes. More bells. Dark coin, okay. Ding, 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 ding. Two. It's probably like four of them. Yep, there's the last one. There we go. Unlocked it. <coughs> easy, easy puzzle. Yep, and this must be where the boss is. Alright, so let's save. Just in case. I don't think we'll die, but we might. Because I do a lot of damage right now. Boggard! Lando, is everybody okay? Everyone but Amanda. Hold on, Boggard. We'll get you out. No good. Devious's powerful magic locks the cage. The spell won't break until he's defeated. Drat! Don't worry about me. This is just more payback for abandoning Medusa. Payback? If I'd used mana power without hesitating, she might have been okay. But sacred mana power, it can't be used to help only one person. Otherwise the fabric of society unwinds. Would that really... I made up my mind. Though I tried to do the right thing, I was wrong. Hmm. From Devious and Dark Lord's perspective, the Mana Clan and I are enemies who hoarded the power of mana. Boggard. Alright. So... Here we go. I remember this. This is a hard battle. 
So nice of you to come, you wretched human. Devious. Now that my mother has passed on, I have no reason to stay in this world. Before I depart, I would like to clear up a certain matter. Devious. You'll pay for what you did to Amanda. Yeah, he turns into this crazy, like... It reminds me of, like, Ammonite. Oh, this is gonna make me dizzy. It's kind of hard to hit him because it's just constantly spinning. Yeah, see, he doesn't do a lot of damage to me because we're... We're kind of OP at this point. Oh. oh, this is gonna make me so dizzy. I'm sorry if you're watching this and you don't do well with motions. Oh. Careful, careful. Oh, and I'm blinded. Well, now I'm not. I gotta start hitting those combos. There we go. That was super easy. <laughs> I remember that being really hard the first time I beat this game. Wretched human, finish me off. No, now we're even. I told you to finish me. Are you leaving me wounded so I will taste fear and pain? That's just as well. Hey, that's not it at all. But I... Devious. Shall I end it for you? That voice! Julius. Please forgive these foolish humans. This is their idea of justice. To let you live with nothing but pain left. No, stop talking like you know everything! Then why not take your sword and grant his last wish, end his suffering? But I... I couldn't. Or you could heal his wounds. I happen to have some elixir of life. I'll even let you have a sample. I refuse. I am the proud son of the Medusa family. I'll decide my own fate. Arr! My boy, hesitate not when you take up arms. If you have even an ounce of uncertainty, you have no right to raise your sword at all. Hesitate not. With that resolve, you may one day wield the legendary Sword of Mana. Is he dead? What an idiot. <laughs> what the hell is that thing? His life! I get his life! A bitter, aged soul, blending deep despair with profound suffering. Succulent. What is that? <laughs> My thoughts exactly. <laughs> Devious. Sis. Medusa. Amanda. In the end, we we weren't able to save anybody. The anger and sadness over losing Amanda. It all exploded when I took revenge on Devious. But even then, my heart didn't feel lighter. I'm beginning to understand what Kiba meant. It's laughable to think a guy like me could ever use the Sword of Mana. Mando, do you mind if I sing a song? For my sister, and for Lady Medusa, and Mr. Devious. Would you use this, Luster? It's Lord Granz's lute. It was the favorite memento of someone who loved him very much. Is it going to be the same song? It is the same song. <laughs> oh, maybe it's a little different. 
Lester's haunting melody echoes through the town. Hearts are touched. Even the hearts of the fallen are moved. Oh, so that's a new area we can go into now. Because that, like, I made my way there. I might have done it in an episode, but I made it there a lot. The melody even reaches as far as Grand's castle. What the hell is that thing? I forgot about that character, but it's... It's nuts. Mr. Lando, before you go... Genoa. Am I gonna get another spirit? Yeah. Who the light spirit? Lady Medusa had a special place in her heart for this spirit. I entrust it to you. Genoa, I have no right to accept this. It's alright. Please take it. Think fondly of Lady Medusa when you, whenever you put it to use. But... Please, go quickly. Before my bitterness gets the best of me. Noah. I'm Luna. That's because I'm a moon spirit, you know? Pleased to meet you. You know what? Lady Medusa had high hopes for you in the future. The future? And you know what else? You can't live in the past. Gotta look ahead. That means you have to think ahead. If you're planning to step into the future, I'll go with you. Can't sit here moping forever, can you? Thanks, Luna. Receive Luna, a moon spirit. So it's a moon spirit, not a light spirit, like I thought. I'm sorry, but could you all leave me alone for a while so I can clear my thoughts? Go on ahead to Grand's Castle without me. Oh, we're going to Grand's Castle next, I guess. Lando! I'll stay behind and wait for Sir Boggart. You and Lester go on. Grant's castle is past Miasma Glen. Okay, try to keep Boggart's spirits up. Let's go, Lester. Yeah. Cool. So we're gonna go to those Miasma fields, which are actually down this way. But, actually, I'm gonna end the episode here, just because that was, like, a good section, like, a good chunk and lots of like storyline and stuff so i'm gonna save here and then next time we'll go through miasma glen so i want to thank you guys so much for watching this episode of sword of mana go ahead and like comment subscribe share hit that bell so you get notified whenever i upload a new video and i'll see you in the next one bye